Hello everyone and welcome to Wine Raccoon. It is such a beautiful day outside, I decided that I was going to try to film outside so hopefully it doesn't get too loud. Today I have the perfect number six, Shiraz. This one is a 2020 from South Australia. And this is supposed to have notes of blueberry, spices, and mocha. Let's go ahead and take this one for a spin. Right away, I'm predominantly getting spices. It's a very generic term, I know. But that really is the best way to, to put it. It's, it's definitely spices on the back of the tongue and the, and the back sides of the tongue. I think you do get a little bit of mocha flavor, like a coffee type of flavor um, toward the back of the tongue as well. I'm really trying to pinpoint that blueberry, but I'm really struggling to do so. Blueberry tends to be such a faint flavor. Frankly, I'm usually surprised if I can pick it up um, because w w when you <laughs> compare the flavor, you know, blueberries paired with spices and mocha, those other two are really heavy. Um, so I'm not surprised that blueberry would get lost even if it is the first tasting note on the list. This one is a little bit dry, and that kind of comes with the territory of focusing on those spices and, and um, the mocha as the primary flavor. <sighs> Definitely, I mean, it, it says on here it's supposed to be a pretty full body, and it is. Um, so it's got more like potent flavor. So, you know, I've been sipping on this a little bit. I'm really not getting the blueberry, um, unfortunately. So, you know, give this a try for yourself. Maybe you do get the blueberry and I just don't. Um, yeah, that's, that's really kind of it. Um, a little bit dry, focused on the, that, those spices and mocha. And that's, that's kind of it. So... Um, I think that's going to be it. On a scale of 0 to 5, uh, 0 being I never want to drink this again, and 5 being I want to drink this every day, I'd probably give this a 2. A um, little disappointed I didn't get those blueberry notes, and I feel like a lot of wines have the spice, kind of like the spice as the primary tasting note, and I just felt like this could have, there could have been more to this. So, that's why I'm giving it the rating I am. Um, if you have any questions, comments, or recommendations, feel free to drop those in the comments below, and I look forward to having a sip again with you soon.